leader of the Biafra customary government, BCG, Asari Dokubo, has said the region Peter Obi hails from is a plus for the former Abia state governor in the 2023 presidential race. Politics Nigeria reports that Obi, a member of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, declares his intentions to run for presidency on March 24th in Oka, Anambra State, at a gathering in gathering of traditional rulers. He was running mate to former Vice President Atiku Abubaka in the 2019 presidential election. Dukubo, although doesn't fancy Obi, he concedes the 60-year-old is maybe the best among the aspirants from Nigeria's southeast region. He said what is going for Peter Obi is because he is from the southeast and by virtue of coming from the southeast, he can have a shot because it is only the southeast that have not produced any candidates. Any president, Dokubo said in a recent Facebook Live, monitored by this newspaper. For national inter uh, integration, fairness and equity, that is what is going for him. That is a plus for Obi. He is from the southeast and as it is as it appears, maybe he is the best among the aspirants from the southeast. <laughs> I don't understand what a uh, Dokubo is trying to say because the same Dokubo told us that uh, this man never achieved anything apart from Boho and Rose. But now he's not even saying anything. He's only saying that uh, it's a plus for him because uh, Southeast has not even produced any uh, precedent uh, for some time now. Why did he not say that before, before now? And now he's not even talking about uh, anything. But he said maybe he's the best among the aspirants. So why the change of a uh, uh, statement? Well, Obi is not just the best from the Southeast, but he's the very best among all the aspirants now in the old country. Asari has finished the money he received last week. You can imagine. And he's now saying the real truth of the matter. Obi the rock. God will see us through. The beauty for, of democracy is freedom of speech. Your assessment is based on ethnic origin. Others have better parameters for assessing aspirants to political offices outside ethnicity and religion. Well, the man doesn't even know which state Peter will be uh, hails from. Which side you did, Baba? Asai Dokubo, which side you did? This man is a confused person, talking with two sides of his mouth. Bible doesn't lie. The math that you used to condemn will be same you will be used to praise him. Maybe Asari wants Obi to give him 20 million naira as Namdekano gave him for free. Militant vagabond. A gambler like you talking about Obi, he is the best of all. Basket mat is leaking again. Nigeria isn't the creeks where your breakfast comes from. Speak, you have the biggest mouth and people who believe your words are lunatics. Leave Obi uh, for now. Talkative, Shebi, you were insulting him the other day just to be noticed. Did you actually conduct a proper comparison amongst all the aspirants from the Southeast and came out with what you are now saying? Or have you been sorted? Confusion, don't happen. No. Anambra State, Abia State, which one now? We need Peter Obi, Nigerians need him. Let Southeast leaders come together for the betterment of Nigerians. How many mouths do you speak from? Oh, sorry. How many mouths do you speak from? Mistake is so, okay. Well, basket mouth don't even start to leak again. It don't start to leak again. Well, Obi is from uh, Anam Brastis, not Abia. Will he not change tomorrow again? It talks anyhow. <laughs> Everybody knows what everyone says at some point in time. If these guys are always saying anything just for them to be relevant or for them to be noticed or to seek attention he does not speak well of them in the future you have all of those things, things that you are saying will be used against you because people already know that you cannot be trusted just like if anika day is beginning to say one thing or the other maybe he's even regretting of course he should be regretting why he joined apc for now asari dokubo is saying another thing hey this is <laughs> this is really 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 serious uh, he said, maybe he's the best among the aspirants, best among the aspirants, and he's been asked to go and do his own work very well. Okay. Uh, he said he doesn't fancy Obi. He consists the 60-year-old 
may be the best among the aspirants from Nigeria South East region. And some people say, no, 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 no. It can't be. <laughs> Even from the old country, we can see, we can feel it, we can, we can, we can, we can smell it. Uh, what is going for Peter will be according to what uh, Dokubo said is because he is from the southeast, and by virtue of coming from southeast, he can have a shot. You can imagine that he can have a shot because it is only the southeast that have not produced any candidates, any president. Dokubo said in a recent Facebook live monitored by this newspaper. So that is to tell you that uh, this man is not matured at all. He's not matured at all. One, in one way, you will say one thing. In another breath, you will say another thing. For national integration, fairness, and equity, that is what is going for him. That is 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 a plus for Hubi. Hey, Asari Dukubo. Just like somebody said, that those who are listening to this kind of people, eh, that means there's something wrong somewhere. Something is really wrong somewhere. Because you cannot be here and there. If you are standing on something, stand on that. If you are not standing, do not stand. So why didn't he think all this through? Because he ought to have said it from the beginning. But he only came and said, oh, be just, you know, what is there in that man? So didn't he know that, okay, this is what he's saying. Because even what he said that, oh, maybe he's the best among the aspirants from that south is, But it goes beyond that. Next time again, we'll come and say another thing. But the truth, one thing is that, Truth is always constant, no matter how you try to change it, no matter how you want to to obtain it, truth truth remains constant. You can leave it, you can say whatever you want to say, you can go this way, you can go that way, but one day you will still come back. The truth is always constant. You will still come back and meet that truth. Your conscience will be telling you, or oh, some people say some things out of ignorance, but at the end of the day, they will still come to the realization of the truth that they were ignorant of but some people know the truth but they just want to do the unthinkable they just want to cause confusion here and there so they will still come back and meet the truth it cannot be hidden because we know that it will be a lot of people have been saying a lot of things about him but the fears that people have is that they might not give him the opportunity because the people who are in incompetent those who do not have the interest of the people at heart those who they believe some people believe that they will have opportunity of sharing the wealth of the country among themselves that this one will be able to release and uh -huh, those are the people they want or those who are religious uh, by god those who are ethnic by god they are the ones that they always push those who are so that have soft standard of integrity they will be pushing them but the ones that they know that we do the right thing they will never because they think that oh this person is stingy yeah he will not be able to release funds he will not be able to release this at the expense of the general masses so guys let's hear your opinion and let's know your thoughts on this thank you